So now maybe you think, how can I generate an empty matrix in NumPy? So in order to do so, you can simply use, for example, the empty function in order to do so. For example, you want to pass a 3 by 3 matrix. And for example, if I store the results in a variable, let's say called x, and if I print the x variable, and if I run a code, so as you can see, this is a 3 by 3 matrix, but as you can see, these values are not empty because it is not possible to generate a 3 by 3 matrix in which all of the values are empty. And here is a question, what do you mean by empty? So it is not possible to generate a 3 by 3 matrix in which all of the values are empty. But here, as you can see, these values are chosen randomly, completely randomly. And this leads to fast creation of this matrix. And here is the question, what is the benefit and use case of the MT function? And the use case of the MT function is this, that you generate uh, this matrix. And for example, along your program, you want to use, for example, for loops or etc. in order to uh, manipulate these values. So for example, take this simple example. So as you can see, I've created an empty matrix. And then using for loop, I have defined the values inside this matrix. And maybe you say, okay, I can use, for example, the zeros function in order to do so. And for example, in order to create an empty matrix, I can use the zeros function in order to create a zeros matrix. And then I want to use these for loop. So that's true, but remember that the empty function, the creation, of the empty matrix is much faster than the creation of this type of matrices. Because for example, in the zeros function, you have a constraint that all of the values should be zero. But in the empty function, you don't have any constraint. All the values are chosen randomly. And also remember that you can pass whatever D type that you want. For example, I want to pass the integer D type. So if I run a code, you can see the data types, the types of data is integer. Now I really suggest you to watch this video, which is on the screen now.